Shopify versus WordPress, which is better? Hello guys and welcome to the channel. In today's video, I will be talking about Shopify and of course WordPress and we're gonna generally see which one is better, which one does the things better, which one goes better for your average use and all that type of stuff. And of course, starting with actually Shopify. It is an all-in-one, of course, a e-commerce platform offering everything from your online store editor to domains and hosting. Of course, you can take Shopify into the real world with an integrated point-of-sale system. You can sync up the online and the personal sales with the built-in inventory and, of course, the order management systems. On the other hand, WordPress is one of the web's most popular content management systems. It doesn't come preloaded with as many features as Spotify maybe, but that's because you can add them so easily with plugins and manual coding. In this way, it lets you, of course, fully customize your website design with unique workflows. So basically, if we are, of course, gonna like see which one is better, Shopify is best for businesses that just want to hit the ground running because it's designed with specifically for online storefronts. You'll have all the tools you need at your disposal without too much tinkering. So it's a little easier. But of course, WordPress makes more sense for the businesses that want to take the customization into their own hands. For example, if you want your website to be more than just a selling tool, WordPress gives you all the flexibility with additional templates even, and of course, more and more features. So they are both good on their own merits, but of course, if you know coding, I would say WordPress. If you don't, I would say Shopify. So basically, let's we can just go over the um, other stuff. Basically, Shopify is like in on average after the trial uh, period, it's like $29 per month. What, meanwhile, WordPress is like not free version is $45 per month, but you can always like use their website domains like free stuff. So that's like a little like balancing thing. You can have an easier option and you can have a more planned but paid option. Uh, the only like big difference is Shopify gives you unlimited storage. Meanwhile, WordPress is like up to 50 gigabytes, but on an online shop, you wouldn't need that extra space too much anyway. So the unlimited storage is a little extra, not needed. Their help and of course, customer support is generally the same. But of course, um, if we go over the more important stuff, for different, of course, integrations and everything. Uh, you can basically, if you wanna like, um, just get up and running with your shop as fast as you can with a one-time solution that if you are not, of course, well-versed in web design, I would say go with Shopify. And of course, if you want to customize your online store, have time and skill to install plugins, and just like have time with the code, I would say WordPress. And of course, depending on your skills, the website you use will be all up to you.